In this video, we're going to learn how to find the longest string in a list using Python. So if we have a list of strings like this, let's say strings is equal to red and orange and green, the longest string in this list is orange because orange is six characters long and green is five and red is three. What we wanna do is find the longest string in this list. There's a few different ways to solve this problem. We could manually implement an algorithm using a Python loop and if statement, or we could call the built-in Python max function and solve this problem in one line. I'll show you both techniques. For the algorithm, we'll go through the list one string at a time. If the string we're currently looking at has a length that's longer than the longest string we found so far, we'll make that string and its length the new longest string. Once we reach the end of the list, we'll have identified the longest string in the list. We'll have two variables to keep track of the longest string we found and the length of that string. So we'll have here max length is equal to, and we'll initialize it to negative one because any string in this list is going to have a larger length than negative one. We'll set the initial max string equal to none because there is no max string yet. Then we'll loop through the strings one at a time. We'll have here for string in strings. So this for loop is going to run for each string in this list. And each time it does, string is going to be set to the next string in that list. What we'll do is check to see if the length of that string is greater than max length the length of the longest string found so far. So we'll have here, if the length of the current string is greater than the length of the longest string found so far, then we found a new longest string. In that case, we're going to update max length and max string. So we'll set max length equal to the length of this new longest string, and we'll set max string equal to this new longest string. So by the time this loop is done, we'll have checked each string in the list and we'll have updated max string to the string with the longest length found. We'll output max string. Down here, we'll have print and max string. We'll save our program and run it. And we'll get here orange as expected. If we want to better understand how our algorithm is working, we could insert some print statements so for example, in the for loop body here, we could output each string that we check and its length. We could have here print and check colon, and we could output the string that we're currently checking with string as the second argument. We could output its length with print and length colon, and then len string. And if we save this and run our program, we can now more directly see in the program output how our for loop is going through each string in this list. And each time we check a string, we're able to find the length of that string using the len function. One more thing we could do is output the new longest string and the new longest string length. Whenever this if statement condition is true and we found a new longest string. So down here, we could have print and we'll have new max length colon and we'll output the new max length and we'll have print and new max string colon and we'll output the new longest string max string. We'll save this and run our program again. And now we can see when we check the string red, there is a new max length and new max string. And that's because red with a length of three is greater than the initial max length of negative one. Then when we check the string orange, again, we have a new max length of six and a new max string orange because six is greater than the max length of three. But when we check green, there is no update to max length or max string. And that's because green with a length of five is not greater than the existing max length of six. So when this loop and algorithm stops, max string is going to be set to orange, which is correct. 
Now there's actually a way we can solve this problem in a single line using Python's built-in max function. Let's do that now. So here we'll have max string is equal to, and we'll call max. Now, if we just pass max strings, what it's going to return is the lexicographically largest string. So if we save this and run it now, we'll get red. If instead we want the max function to return the longest string in the list, we can use the optional parameter key. We can have here, comma, key is equal to, and we'll set it equal to the function len. So now what's going to happen is the function len is going to be applied to each item in this list and it's the return values of calling len that are going to be used to establish the maximum item in this list, which is now going to be the item with the longest length. So we'll save this and try it out. And now we get orange because orange is the longest string in this list. So this is how we can find the longest string in a list using Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.